have a little yarn package to open. My advent calendar this year is from Earl Grey Fiber Company and it is Alice in Wonderland themed, so that's exciting. It's pretty. It actually looks a lot like the uh, Artemis skein that uh, Lauren made for me for my Moon Club pouch samples. Uh, I like that it has a tiny little label on it. That's cute. I don't think I've gotten an advent calendar that had labels. Um, and it actually has the name of it on there too. So this is Cheshire Cat. That's fun. Hello. As you can see, the Halloween decorations are still up. In theory, we're fixing that today. Uh, I have a coffee advent calendar this year from Yawn Brew, um, and this is a little packet of beans. So I'm getting different coffee beans every day. Buttercup's very excited about it. And uh, I'm going to grind them and do a little pour over with them, and we'll see if I can tell the difference in coffee flavors, or if I'll just be like, this tastes good. <laughs> Alright, I have made my pour over and I actually took a sip of it already to see if uh, how much or if I wanted to put cream and sugar in it and I didn't want to put any cream and sugar in it and I only drink black coffee when I think it's like really really yummy so it's pretty good. Mm, it is good. Yeah, I don't have any sugar or cream in it. It's just black and it's like really light and mild and not too bitter. It's awesome. Uh, it is a honey processed coffee, which means that they leave 70% of the uh, coffee cherry fruit on it, I guess, which is not something that I knew what that meant, but I think I've had honey processed coffee from Trader Joe's before. So it's good. I like it. There are chickens in my bathroom. If you don't listen to the podcast or follow me on Instagram. That might be news to you, but if you do either of those other things, you've seen lots of pictures and heard me talk a lot about them. But today is the last day that they are going to be in the bathroom. They were supposed to go out today. They are old enough to go out today, but it's the coldest day of the year so far. There was actually some snow and ice on the ground. And tomorrow it's supposed to be warmer, so they're going to go out tomorrow, but I thought I would show you their current inside accommodations. So this is my bathtub. It's full of chickens. Hi chickens. The top one is Winifred, the one to the right is Merriweather, and those bottom two white ones are Flora and Fauna. The black one peeking out is Margo, and there's a red one who we can't see at the moment whose name is Mim. So yep, these are the chickens. Um, they're in this plastic tub in my bath. Uh, I will obviously be cleaning the shower extensively tomorrow. And uh, that's their water thing. And they're huge and they need to go outside. Hi Vlogmas watchers. Um, it's around five o'clock and I am just finishing up with my standard work day for the day. I did a bunch of stuff and now I need to knit on a lace project that I cannot show you. Uh, it is a commission and I am not allowed to show it on the internet and it's due oh, less than a week from today so I really need to work on it and so I can't show you what I'm working on but I guess I'll show you a shot of me sitting on the couch listening to podcasts sped up and not actually show you what I'm working on. Uh, I have worn assorted knitwear today because it's very cold. Right now I'm wearing my practically perfect mitts which are a fingerless mitt pattern that I designed. Um, I like them because they have 
the short finger cuff area so I can still type without my hands being impeded. And I am currently wearing my long distance coven shawl, uh, which is another pattern of mine that is a triangle shawl featuring a uh, subtle diamond pattern in garter and stockinette stitch you can see there. That is two skeins of, uh, or actually it's four total, but two fingering weight yarns held together uh, to create a marling effect, uh, which makes it basically like a DK weight shawl. So it's nice and warm and cozy. Um, yeah, I guess I'm gonna make some tea and uh, pretty much sit and work on this thing for the rest of the night. I don't think I'm gonna do anything too interesting uh, and this is kind of going to be the name of the game for Blogmas for a bit. I have a couple commissions, uh, this one that's due on Monday and uh, one that's due later in the month that are going to be taking up a lot of my time. So I'm not going to be able to show you much knitting stuff per se. <laughs> Hi, Buttercup. Hi. I came out to visit Chad and his chicken coop process. This is the chicken run. Chad's on a ladder, so it's a very tall chicken run. It has a roof, and he's working on getting that last top bit of hardware cloth in so that they'll be all protected. This door doesn't have hardware cloth on it yet either, but there's their coop. It's full of tools and stuff. going to be nice. Who any thoughts, Chad? Leave me alone. I'm putting this stuff well, this on. This is about to drop. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll leave then. Going to bed now. <laughs> going to read my book from my fancy new Kindle. And tomorrow, bird eviction. Bird eviction. Chaos will ensue. <laughs>